in the Himalayan rocks. What type of rocks we have? We have uh, sedimentary rocks of marine origin plus the great Himalayas, they have uh, igneous and they have uh, crystalline rocks. Okay, they will have uh, granitic and they have gneiss rocks. Plus, we also have boulders, we also have uh, stones and we have rocks of uh, fluvial origin. Ye kahan par hai? Shivaliks. Shivaliks are a very, very different type of a range. Shivaliks, mein, correct. So Shivaliks are what? Shivaliks are uplifted what? They are up, what are they? Are they uplifted okay, area or not? Yes or no? Yes. yes, they are. But uplifted what? They are uplifted foothills. They are uplifted alluvial fans. So imagine this is the Himalayas or ye is ka foothill hai. Okay, there are foothills here. The rivers come down, rivers come down and the rivers deposit alluvial fans. The river deposit alluvial fans. The ye zone hai, which is the zone of, of fluvial depositions. Agar compression hota raha, then this part also gets uplifted. So what we have, the Great Himalayas, Middle Himalayas, and the foothills have got uplifted. So, Great Himalayas ka alag composition hai, Middle Himalayas ka alag composition hai, and the Shivaliks have a different type of a composition. Okay? Or iske beyond, you also have Trans Himalayas. So you must know the structural differences between the ranges. Great Himalayas, sedimentary rocks plus you have got granite and gneiss. Trans Himalayas, sedimentary rocks plus you also have uh, surface or volcanism features. Middle Himalayas, ye wala jo hai, this is mainly okay, marine uh, sedimentary rocks. The middle Himalayas, they are mainly marine sedimentary rocks. So, middle Himalayas, they have okay, the marine sedimentary rocks mainly. Anybody know the name of the rocks here? Just to add information. You may have been told, may not have been told. But I am adding something. Okay, fine. So, you, should, you can write that down. If you don't know, Okay. See, some of these facts, essay facts, hai, agar nahi pata hai, koi problem nahi hai. But if you can know and write it, it only adds an edge to your answer, that's all. So, as a you know, huge information base nahi hai. But if you know the names, it helps better. So, what are the marine sedimentary rocks of Middle Himalayas mainly called as? They are called as pneumolithic rocks. N U M M U L I T H I C. Pneumolithic rocks. Anybody knows why? Why are they called as pneumolithic rocks? Because they are sourced from a type of marine organism called as pneumolites. Okay. Pneumolites are one type of marine organisms. Pneumolites or yehi organisms ke depositions they are called as pneumolithic sediments. So middle Himalayas mein these sediments are the dominant ones. That's why we say middle Himalayas. Okay, when was it formed? Which time? Miocene times. So Miocene times mein okay middle Himalayas were predominantly of marine origin. They are predominantly of marine origin. Okay? And Shivaliks, these are not marine origin. What are they? They are of fluvial origin. They are fluvial origin. Means, what is it? They are rivers related. They are part of the Himalayan system. 
बस शिवालिक्स का अलग ओरिजिन है शिवालिक्स के अलग रॉक्स हैं ठीक है एंड वाई बिकॉज शिवालिक्स आर अपलिफ्टेड हिमालयन फूट हिल्स शिवालिक्स आर अपलिफ्टेड हिमालयन फूट हिल्स सो वॉट आर द फूट हिल्स टूडे कॉल्ड एस तो यहां पर एक नया बन गया फूट हिल्स क्या बोलते हैं इसको अब भब्बर प्लेन सादर भब्बर प्लेन सो थिंक ऑफ द शिवालिक्स वेर ओल्डर भब्बर प्लेन दे हैव गॉट अपलिफ्टेड सो हाउ डू वी नो दट शिवालिक्स आर फ्लू इन ओरिजिन हाउ डू नो दिस बिकॉज रॉक्स हैव बोल्डर्स रॉक्स हैव स्टोन रॉक्स आर राउंडेड इन नेचर जहां पर भी रॉक्स राउंडेड होगा ना इट्स बिकॉज ऑफ रिवर प्रोसेस रॉक्स आर रोलिंग डाउन एंड दे बिकेम राउंड इन शेप द प्रेजेंस ऑफ बोल्डर्स द प्रेजेंस ऑफ स्टोन फ्लूवियल ओरिजिन स्टोन टेल्स अस द शिवालिक्स इज नॉट मरीन शिवालिक्स इज फ्लूवियल इन ओरिजिन ए कॉमन रॉक मिलता है शिवालिक्स में कॉल्ड एज कॉन्ग्लोमेरेट्स कॉन्ग्लो मेरेट्स वन टाइप ऑफ सेडिमेंट्री रॉक्स ऑफ फ्लूवियल ओरिजिन कॉन्ग्लोमेरेट्स तो शिवालिक्स में क्या है शिवालिक्स में बोल्डर्स है शिवालिक्स हैज अ वेरी कोर्स टेक्सचर सेडिमेंट्स इट हैज वेरी कोर्स टेक्सचर सेडिमेंट्स इट हैज लॉट ऑफ कॉन्ग्लोमेरेट्स इट हैज लॉट ऑफ स्टोन्स and the stones are rounded stones this proves the shivaliks must have been okay a flood plains once upon a time and they got uplifted shivaliks were alluvial fans and they got uplifted boulders conglomerates the very coarse textured sediments means grain size large hai marine sediments are more fine okay यहां लिखा है मैं सेडिमेंट्री रॉक्स प्लस सरफेस वोल्कैनिज्म जो बसाल्टिक रॉक्स आए हैं बिकॉज ऑफ हॉटस्पॉट्स